What is going on guys, it is Bucky, and welcome to another app review for one of my, well, not favorite games, but it's a game, and it's called Ski Ball. Now, what this Ski Ball is, is pretty much the same Ski Ball you played at Arcade. Uh, they actually made it pretty uh, similar to that. So, just open it right here, and in case you can't figure out how to play it, just go ahead and click play right there. And it'll load, and it'll take you to this little Ski Ball screen. And this light in my room is really stinking. I think it's about to blow. So if I start to catch on fire, oh, God, it stinks. Let's see if I can give you, see that light? Let's see if I can, oh, never mind. Just trust me. Anyways, back to the game before I suffocate. Um, the point of the game is to pretty much get the balls in this little ring right here. And the different rings are worth different points. And in order to fling them, just put your finger on the screen and you can fling them upward like that. So just drag them upward just like this. And aside from just doing that, you can also put your thumb on the screen and flick it like this. Let me see if I can get it. Again, I never do this. All right, I'm telling you that is how you do it and you see I just did it. But it's really hard to do that and it's like not accurate at all. So why would you ever do that? I don't know. Don't do it. That's what I'm just saying. So, again, like I said, anytime a cup is highlighted, let me see if I can get one highlighted. Um, see this cup is highlighted right there? This means that if you get it in that cup, it's bonus points. But that's one of the hardest cups to get it in, so I'm not going to get it there. But I sure will try. Ah, oh, so close, you little son of a... Oh. And let me just throw my last one and oh great the lowest thing you can possibly get that's pretty good so now that you're done you get rewarded a certain amount of tickets I got eight depending on how well you do that's not very good but this is your total tickets right here 51 and you can go ahead and pick more if you want to do more or done if you want to go back to the main screen and the main screen gives you two other options that I didn't tell you about the first of all redeem is to pretty much cash in your tickets and get tons of fabulous prizes and so remember we have 51 tickets total we won like eight that game i think so what do we have to choose from headphones not interested an eraser maybe um we have this cool glitter bracelet but i already got one so what i really want is this card right here see this card is going to come in handy why i have no idea but i'm going to buy this and i'm also going to buy this rare lollipop because it says rare and I pretty much just buy anything that says rare because I'm pretty easily influenced so it goes achievement unlocked you have a glow in the dark tongue see that's really what I'm going for just kinda small little prizes like that to boost my day see now I'm gonna be happy for the rest of the day so let's go ahead and click exit and now your other option loot is pretty much all the prizes that you won so far so here's all my prizes that I've ever won playing this and the, the only point of this is pretty much is to show it off to your friends. So let's see what I got. I got a custom old ski ball. I got this rare lollipop. Oh, not bad. Um, I got this card I just bought. Um, the sneezing panda from YouTube. A half-eaten donut. All right, I got it. Don't need to do that. Um, let's see. I got this fabulous mustache right here. Um, a banana and a glitter pencil. So, you know, I got a pretty good stash right here. I think I'll be good to go for a while. But, yeah, that's the basics of the game. I'm just going to exit that. Um, it's just a game pretty much to keep you busy. And the more you play it, the better you get. So, I'm going to go ahead and rate this game a 7, a 7 out of 10. Because it's pretty fun to play. But, you know, there's not really a whole lot to it. It's just pretty much the same thing over and over. So, for the price, I think it's like $0.99 cents or $1.99. It's definitely worth it to buy. So I would highly recommend buying it and getting it. Um, again, don't forget to subscribe. And if you want me to review any more apps, then just leave me a comment here and let me know. So for now, thank you guys for watching. I'm going to be playing this for about the next three hours. So thank you again, and I'll see you later.